My name is Michael Lowry. I'm from Indianapolis, Indiana. And um, the first time that I came to the Harrison Center was back in 2016. I came for a um, summer with my um, summer class. We had walked over to the Harrison Center from Heron and uh, we were sitting in the city gallery at first. And at first, to be completely honest, I was not interested. I was like, I just want to come back to Heron so that I can finish summer academy and start my school year as a freshman. But um, we came into Spec Gallery and while we were in there, I heard this um, sound coming from the stage. And I was like, what is that? And I thought it was just cars passing by for traffic. And I just happened to turn around. And I saw the this door open and I saw a couple of interns leaving out. And I was like, I've never seen anything like that before. Mm -hmm. So when they left out, I just went um, under to the where the door opened at. And I just saw this whole studio in there. I was like, okay, I need to come here. When I first started getting more interested into purchasing or having the thought of purchasing artwork, sometimes when I would see certain pieces, like it would speak to me subconsciously in a way. It's those things that also encourage me that I'm like, I think I do need artwork too. You know, it's, it's, it's an unexplainable feeling almost, to be completely honest. One of the first Fridays I was volunteering, I was very intrigued by seeing people as soon as they would see a piece of art and they would just stare at it for amount of times. And I'll be like, yeah, I think they're gonna purchase that piece. But I was just really encouraged by that. And I was like, I think I'm gonna buy a piece one day. So one first Friday, I just happened to um, be coming through a gallery and I saw this one piece, I just saw koi fish, which is one of my favorite animals like in existence because they're just so calm when they move through the waters. I was like, I need that piece. Like, I, I need it. I don't know where I'm going to put it, <laughs> but I need it. Just looking at that piece of artwork and just being able to be inspired sometimes that quickly. I just really think it's important to just be more immersed. You may not have a whole gallery in your living room. You may only just have images you may look up on Google or Bing or something, but something can always grab your attention. It's definitely important for creatives and artists to have something that encourages them day to day. You need something to keep going in life. So I think that's why it's so important to purchase artwork, especially local artwork. You know, when you purchase local, you know, you have that connection right down the street and no telling what artist to artist connection or artist to citizen, what, that, what type of connection that may bring in the future. Art is art at the end of the day. It's just how you take it in and how it expresses itself to you. That's what really makes art, art.